What's up, y'all? And welcome to First Attempt. Today, we're going to be... Oh, oh, moving stuff around. There you go. Taking this pin and this Nerf gun and try to knock it down for the first time. Let's do it. <laughs> God dang. grounding a lot of planes so people I mean because all planes are getting too much turbulence planes are getting too much turbulence because of the climate so they have to ground a lot of them okay well what can I ramble about about climate change um we should talk about Toy Story and just in general or like what it means to you what it what Why toy did you feel like you're upset and then expand on that Uh, what's up, y'all, and welcome to Nico Rambles. Today, we're going to be talking about Toy Story, not four, not specifically four, but we're going to be talking about Toy Story as a whole. Toy Story, such a grand movie series franchise, probably one of the best Disney movies ever. I can say that. They evolutionized the animation space and they really, really nailed Toy Story 4. Toy Story 3 did, didn't really feel like the best ending in my opinion because it felt like it's, it was a potential ending, but I think because of Toy Story 4, it really showed that it was like, you know what? We could have ended this better. Toy Story 4, I mean like spoilers, if you've not seen the movie yet, I don't, I don't know why you would click on a video about Toy Story and not expect me to talk about the new one. Whatever. Toy Story Four. The the soon as the soon as the movie starts, you know they do their whole little thing and kind of introduce what the story almost gonna be about. A little foreshadowing, you know, and how they just go. You got a friend in me. You got a friend in me. That song hit me. So it's hitting me, even me singing. It. <laughs> it felt like this is the end. I don't know if that was what they were trying to go for, but it really felt like this was the end of Toy Story. Just right there alone, I was like, oh no, this movie's about to hit in ways that I was not prepared for. Going in and you see the little cloud. They did, they, they, it was a lot of, I guess, quote unquote, callback of the franchise. And I also liked that, that it wasn't really focused around Buzz and like the other characters exactly. But yet Woody as the staple of this franchise, I mean, Buzz is too. I'm not saying that Buzz is not a staple of the franchise, but he, he just was. And it was just like, this is the Woody send off. Now they could come back and you know what? Pixar doesn't really disappoint. So I don't mind if they was like, you know what? Let's just try to do some other things with it. They don't have to, they can literally just leave it alone. I'm happy as a Toys R Us, I mean Toys R Us. I knew I was gonna say it one time. I knew I was gonna say it one time. As a Toys Story fan, I was satisfied. And I liked the fact that it was just about Woody and him trying to still become, still wanting to be a, like the main toy. Even though there were some weird plot holes in that movie where we, we figure out that like Woody is from like the 50s and he, you know, cause he has, he's a pool string toy or whatever. But I wouldn't understand how Andy is playing with an old toy, but it was always presented like it was a new thing. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> you know, we go through that and then finally at the end, we get that, all right, Woody's moving on and becoming a, you know, a, a lost toy. Be one of the lost toys. Peter Pan's lost toys. <laughs> you know that new movie by Disney it's called Peter Peter Pan and the Lost Toys. It, it's it's great. It's a great movie. I will put it on my top ten favorite Disney movies. It's up there with Incredibles too. Pixar is killing it. Pixar, you have not disappointed me yet, and I am very surprised in that actually. Maybe because y'all take more time with y'all work, but I really, well, no, I'm sorry, sorry Pixar. Now I thought about it. No, Cars two, uh, did not like it. But you did make it up with Cars three. It still felt a little short. Cars 3 felt like the real Cars 2, but I'm pretty sure if you ever make a Cars 4, you're gonna kill it. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like, comment, share, 
and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Am I am I out the shot? Am I am I out the shot? <laughs>